What is M and A accretion dilution analysis? Accretion and dilution analysis refer to a simple test that determines the impact of an acquisition or merger on the buying firm's earnings per share. An accretive acquisition or merger is one where the pro forma or post deal earnings per share is greater than the acquirer's EPS before the deal is made. A dilutive acquisition or merger is one where the pro forma EPS is less than the EPS of the acquiring business when it stands alone before the deal is made. Break even. This scenario is pretty self explanatory. Upon a merger or acquisition, the acquiring company would essentially break even. In other words, there would be no impact on the acquirer's EPS. And the company's EPS would be the same before and after the deal is made. So, why is accretion dilution analysis performed? As a general rule, public acquiring companies are reluctant to pursue dilutive transactions due to the potential detrimental effect on their share price. Therefore, a given public buyer's perception of valuation and corresponding bid price is often guided by EPS accretion dilution analysis. However, while certain transactions may not be accretive on day one, they may create escalating value over time. Hence, buyers evaluate the accretive dilutive effects of a transaction on a forward-looking basis taking into account the target's future expected earnings, including growth prospects and other combination effects such as synergies. From the seller's investment bank advisory perspective, the banker typically performs accretion dilution analysis for the public strategic buyers in the process to assess their ability to pay. This requires making assumptions regarding each specific acquirer's financing mix and cost, as well as synergies. The accretion dilution analysis allows the sell side banker to assess the maximum price a given strategic buyer can afford to pay, based on an assumed financing structure and expected synergies, before seeing dilutive EPS. This information can then be used by the sell side advisor in negotiations to persuade the buyer to increase its bid.